There you go. Ice cream cone. <laughs> that cover Greenland and Antarctica. More than three kilometers thick in some places. They contain as much as 75% of all fish. What? The double go? Well, do you? We can tell what was happening. Who do you have to say? Who do you have? earlier this morning but Molly and I are just going out for a little morning walk. Come on honey. Um, what did we do yesterday? Yeah we went to check out that space museum that the kids really liked and so did Brian. <laughs> I think Brian picked it more for him than for the kids but they had a lot of staff that it was really slow so they were kind of all over the kids which was great teaching them at all the stations and so it was nice that we had the place kind of to ourselves. Um, we just got home. We were supposed to go out to the celebration in the Oaks tonight. I bought tickets online and didn't realize that it actually starts on Friday. So luckily we went down there today just to check it out see what parking was going to be like because apparently it's pretty chaotic. So anyways, we will try that on Friday. But instead we just played. There was a really big park there so we played there all afternoon. And then we stopped and got some chicken for supper on the way home. And now we're just being really lazy. And the kids are playing some video games. And Hattie and I are on bed on the bed. She's just chatting away, aren't ya? got back from the French Quarter. We went down there again today. The visitor center was closed on the first day that we went, so we weren't the kids weren't able to do their um, junior ranger badge. So we went down there today. The kids did that, which they were super excited for, and they got sworn in and everything. So that was kind of a neat process. And then we went and had another beignet and cup of coffee at a different cafe, and then just walked the streets and uh, listened to some music. It was really fun. Hi, Eddie. Are you Miss Pooper Duper? Are you Miss Pooper Duper? Are you Miss Pooper Duper? It's taken by Dominic. Not Mom. Dominic. So it's about 11 o'clock now. Um, we're just finishing up the laundry. There's free laundry at the state park, so we're cleaning all of our bed sheets and everything, taking advantage of that. Uh, it's a pretty nice day outside. The kids are um, playing at the park. Me and Hattie are just making some lunch. Brian is vacuuming out the truck. It is a productive and awesome start to the day. Then we're gonna go into town. We have to get an oil change before we go. City Park. Uh, we got some pizza on the way. So we're just having pizza before we head in. I think they open the gates in about half an hour or so. And then we will, we can hear the little train going around. Um, and then we'll head in. So 
We just got in. The lights are so cool in here. It's really nice. Um, so we're just trying to find the train so we can go for a train ride. Are you excited to go on a train, Declan? Yeah! Yeah? yeah. Gonna go choo-choo! And when one starts melting, they all start melting. So we are trying to find our way out of here so we can go home because our poor little kidlets are done. We're locking and loading. We have a big long day today. It's kind of like a two day because we have to stop just for the night. And then, are you catching me? Um, we're stopping just for the night and then we have another about three hours tomorrow to get to Austin. So Brian's just hooking up the trailer and trying to dump it. We're taking Molly for a last walk. And the kids are checking out this little path that they love. It's so cute. Hold on. Walking and talking. Hattie's not very happy with me. We just pulled over at the Texas Info Center. Um, and I thought she was awake and she was fast asleep. So, oh well. Anyways, we're in Texas. And we are just going to check out the information center. <laughs> I can't think of a better place to stretch their legs. This is awesome. There's a little um, pathway behind. So we we're just going for a walk. Are you getting my face happy? So we are up and locked and loaded and ready to go. It's really early. The campsite that we came into last night was not a great one, so we didn't even unhook. We just put the jacks down, slide out, went to bed, woke up, and we are getting out of here. <laughs> um, we have a really short drive today, I think only about an hour and a half, um, and then we'll be just outside of Boston for the week. We totally should have just made the extra drive to more yesterday. We were about an hour, that's all we drove today. Um, and this campsite is so much nicer. Uh, so yeah, Brian's setting up, the kids and I are just investigating the park. Hattie and Betty just woke up from a nap. And um, yeah, then we might go check out Austin. We're about 20 minutes just outside, so we might go into town. It's only like 9.30, so we were up early and got out of there really quick. So yeah, we'll see how long it takes us to set up and see what the kids want to do. We might go into town and check out something. We were just down checking out the botanical gardens here in Austin. It's so, so beautiful. Brian just took the big three for a shower. So Declan's having a little bath all to himself. Yeah, Dad. Are you scooping the water into the bowl? <gasps> Good job. Are you going to fill it up? Are you going to make me an ice cream pie? Ice cream with steak. 
You gonna make me a cake? Yeah, with candles. With candles? Oh. morning we're having our morning play at the park aren't we Hattie it's beautiful and sunny and looks like it's gonna be a gorgeous day out today who do you think you're gonna get it are you gonna get it we're thinking we might just head into Austin and um, you got some ice cream whole one how do you want? How do you want them? How do you want, Daddy? Go. We were looking for uh, the Barton Trail or something like that. I don't know. We couldn't find it. We drove past it a couple times and couldn't find like the path. So we kept driving and we found this huge park that's right by Barton Springs, which is like a natural fed springs and it's like the same temperature all year round. So we're going to come back tomorrow with our swimsuits on and go swimming. They said it was really cold, but we're Canadian.